ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. We have a wonderful season here at the Regent Theater. Welcome to episode four of Regent TV. Tonight we are very excited to be filming on location here at the Regent Theater, Arlington showplace of entertainment since 1916. There's a lot of history here and last weekend, well, we had Elvis in the building and we're still recovering from that, but we're very excited about our upcoming Christmas special, The Calamari Sisters Christmas Carol. I don't know if we're quite ready for it, but that's what we're doing and since most of you are tuning in now in the heart of the Christmas season. I want to wish everybody happy holidays, Merry Christmas, or whatever it is you celebrate. And welcome to Regent TV once again. Thank you for coming. And here are your tickets to January's featured shows. We kick off January in a big way with the Ultrasonic Rock Orchestra's annual New Year's Eve extravaganza. The future of classic rock starts here. January is also extremely special as we kick off 2020 with Magic Month, January's always magic month here at the Regent Theater, a tradition of family fun live magic shows every Saturday morning. Also for families, we've got the Belmont World Film 17th Annual Family Film Festival, and that's the weekend of January 17th. Also, duets, Dua, Motown and more on January 18th, a great live show presented by the folks that it brought you the Aretha Franklin tribute, the Otis Redding tribute, and much more. This is chapter six, the great Leon Beale and friends on January 18th. Also, we've got some great school events coming up. The Real School of Music, based in Burlington and Andover, doing a live showcase on January 11th. And Two weeks later, Arlington High School's Battle of the Bands on January 25th. Always a crazy time here. We're looking forward to that. Not to mention an exclusive film event, the Boston premiere of The Life and Death of Brian Jones from the Rolling Stones. Enjoy. So here we are, smack dab in the middle of the Regent Theater stage, the historic Regent Theater, about to make history, I think, because we're about to talk to the Calamari sisters right here the night before the show begins. It was the night before showtime and all That's through right. the house. Welcome. Thank Hi. you, Leland. <laughs> you guys really don't need an introduction, so I'll let you introduce yourself. Oh, all right. So. I'm Delphine. And I'm Carmela. And we had the, the Calamari, Calamari sisters. sisters of you course. Might have seen us on a bus or two. Yeah. yeah. Broadside yeah. of a bus, I yeah. would say probably. <laughs> probably. <laughs> And this isn't the first time you've been to the Regent Theater, is it? Oh, no, it is our third at third, this is point. It third? I think it's number three. Yeah. Oh, we love it mm -hmm. here. I love Boston. You love do. it. And yeah. what is it you love about Boston? Oh, everything. I love the historic nature. I love all the, like, cobblestone field, everything. Although I keep looking. I hear about this Boston Tea Party. It's famous. I love a good Earl Grey tea. Yeah. So I keep I'm, trying to explain what it was, and she... What is a party? And everyone makes a lot of tea in the, in the waters or something. Mm. I don't know. I'm going to figure it out, though. I'm going to find it. Well, I have a question. Have you ever opened a show before on a full moon? Because I just heard that there is a full moon happening tomorrow. Oh, um, that explains now. a lot. It does. Now, Carmela has given a full moon <laughs> on the opening of a show before. I so that, that's the, a little, and then that's a little we were extra. shut down. There was picketing. Yeah, we had there was not there was an picketing. injunction. There we had to pay a fine. Well, but, but on know, a full we moon, have pretty strict laws yeah. around here. So hopefully that won't that happen won't later. happen. But to answer your question, I think we actually probably have, and all like we've been touring the country since 2009, yeah. and I'm sure at some point yeah. we have opened a show on a full moon with the, as many openings. Don't even say it. As many openings as we've <laughs> had. 
It's true. I'm it's sure. true. Although that sounds real creepy—a full moon. Yeah. Sounds like werewolves. It explains no, it's, why yeah, girls in our family are a little hairy. <laughs> what we're excited about or thrilled about is you're here right up through the end of the year, right through the mm -hmm. holiday yeah. season, into the new year, twenty. I can't believe it. I can't believe we're there. I so, but know. It's, true. it's like the future is now. Yeah. So tell the audience, the Regent TV audience, what they might expect, maybe hmm. where you started. How did this come about? Food, performance. The full history. You want you the know? rundown. Well, we well, have been. A course, short story. We're long. from Bay Ridge, Brooklyn. You know yeah. that, though. We're from Bay Ridge, Brooklyn. And Carmel and I have been singing and dancing in the kitchen oh, with our mom and our forever. grandma Minestrone forever. since we were just little girls. So that yeah. came naturally, the, the joining cooking and music. Now, our stage shows, we've been touring, like I said, since 2009. We have 11 different versions oh my gosh. of our stage shows. The first one was Cooking with the Calamari Sisters, yeah. which we did right here yes, in the we region. Did. Two years ago at this was, point, And right? that was the first. That was the first. Yeah. And people are still talking about it. Oh, there you go. Hubba well, I hope so. Street. I hope they don't just talk, but I hope they come back. This is a brand new show from Nuts to Bolts, brand new show. Yeah. They will be surprised at every turn. Of course, and um, we and are. We do sing. We do dance. And we cook. Do. We're the only all singing, all dancing, all cooking, cooking show out there. Of course, exactly. Yeah. And of course, they can expect to laugh. Well, laughing is the, the especially nowadays. Laughter oh. is what everybody needs. So but important. Yes, they will laugh from beginning yeah. to end. They'll have a great time, and by the time they leave here, they'll feel like a part of the calamari family. Yeah. yeah. And it's so great because the aisles of the Regent Theater were made for rolling in them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah but I hope you have yeah. waterproof seats. You're gonna laugh yeah. yourself silly. Uh, we, Where you depend. We're gonna install those right away. Yeah. <laughs> Special. <laughs> And of course, it is a Christmas themed show. Oh, so lots of holiday music, Absolutely. lots of holiday cheer, a couple of recipes that you might want to try in the holidays. Sure. I'll get a chance to sample, perhaps. How is it? I mean, we're looking at the stage now out mm -hmm. here, and, and, and you actually do real preparation and. Oh, yeah. Oh, good, yes. Food. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. What, that, what would a cooking show me without the cooking? <laughs> Yeah. It's a perfect Christmas gift. Mm -hmm. it, you know what? I think that everyone should run out and grab tickets and put them in the stockings. Oh. Huh? They make great gifts. Experiences oh, are they great don't gifts. They take up much room either. They don't take so much room. Put this all is the true. other stuff in those stockings. Yes, exactly. Well. Yeah. Yes, give the gift of entertainment, and Amen there's no other entertainment like your show. Well, and that's why we thought it was such that's a great a idea to run past that's a truth. the new year, so past Christmas, so that people could get um, the tickets for holiday, you know, sure. for Christmas and the holidays, yeah. and use them, you know, in January or Absolutely. the end of uh, December. It's usually such a letdown on the season's yeah. ending, and this yeah. will just be building up. Exactly. We'll ramp up, exactly. honey, ramp up. We'll keep it going. Yeah. yeah, that's how it should be. We'll yeah. get you warm on a cold winter's night. It may not ever be able to stop. All right, where do you go next? Once you leave, we're going to go back home. Oh, we're thank go back the to New Lord! York. You know, it's been so much to travel. I miss home. Well, yeah, we're going to go back home. Got some men waiting for for me at home. <laughs> A couple. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. And you know, I'm I'm just I I just I I'm I'm pretty much speechless because just <laughs> looking at at I don't think we've ever had anyone so glamorous on our stage before oh. Oh. and really Flatterer. that puts so much time and effort into a show uh -huh. and the Regent Theater has a long history of vaudeville and so forth and it seems to me that you are oh, yeah. out of that tradition. Oh yeah, our show absolutely. has a lot of vaudeville feel to it, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Vaudeville, classic musical theater and yeah. some, you know, with a contemporary flair. We, I like to say that our show is very, very TV audience friendly. Yes. Um, you know, so that, um, yeah. and we engage a lot. It's not, um, you, you don't just sit there and watch it, we engage with the right. audience the entire time. Inter Interactive. Oh. Interactive. Well, because yes. you know, when you're doing a cooking show, yeah, they always yeah. have their audience there. They always have people, and, you know, so we get to actually talk to people yeah. and do, and address them directly. You don't have that, uh, the fourth wall. Is the that what they wall. call it yeah, in the theater? Fourth the you know, fourth wall. That doesn't exist no. in the calamari world. No, not here. That's for sure. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, I was thinking about this. I keep talking to Dell about it. We, we get into the vaudeville thing. I was hoping for a little burlesque, huh? Mm. What do you think? A Christmas holiday strip? 
No, I don't think so. No, I don't think so. I think it's great. I could do wooden spoon pasties. Oh, oh. What do you think? Well, you know, we were we're Arlington's come a long way since the blue laws, you know, and we we do blue serve laws. beer and wine and oh. hard cider here yeah. now for they the would, past few they years. They would need plenty of drinking you, to watch that. Yeah, well, they I, would they need all, plenty. Is, do you prepare yeah. anything in the way of beverage? Or oh, we certainly food? do. We actually one of the things we do is a as a holiday drink. Yeah, but we're not giving it away. Yeah, you got to come and see it if drink. you want. Okay, and if you, you know, know it's very it. simple, and audience members can take oh, that recipe so home good. and make it. It's so you know, and good. of course it's Italian. The entire show's Italian, so the yeah. cocktail's Italian too. Yeah, I mean, and a lot of the the songs are you know tried and true Christmas Christmas songs, but all of our shows, you know, they're very Italian based because that's what we know. It's Rosemary Clooney, Dean Martin, Louis Prima, all the good ones, you know? So, okay, so what is your all time favorite Christmas song? My all time favorite Christmas song? You have one already? Yeah. You know, say what yours is. Well, you don't know what your favorite Christmas song is. No, song? I got to think like, here. Oh, little town of Bethlehem, how shall we see me fly? Mm. That's one of my favorites. It's I think my favorite. Sometimes I it's wish hard it was to very decide, silent no. tonight. <laughs> but no, my favorite, and there's a difference. See, my favorite one is Most Wonderful Time of the Year. <gasps> Love that song. That's a but my favorite thing, my favorite songs are the ones that everybody kind of knows. But when you bring them up, no, they kind of know the first phrase. And Absolutely. then they're like, uh -huh. It's like, yeah. what's the king song that I'm trying oh, to think of? Good King Wences, lots of time. We all know that. Gun, 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 gun. But all we know is that first line. Good King Wences, lots of Nobody knows the verses. And there's always 27 of them. There's a whole bunch of them. Nobody knows them. It's no, true. Even Silent Night, you get to verse yeah. two, and people are like, oh, they don't know it. Oh, they don't know it. Yeah. And like, and as you said, there's a, a lot of music and a lot of dancing and a lot of fun. It's not just Christmas no. music. No, 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 no. no. We always say that our shows are everything and the kitchen sink. Yes. I mean, it's cooking. You're in the kitchen, yeah. but it's singing, dancing. It's a, it's a hoot and a holler. Well, what One I love, too, is it's just... You gals are bringing people together during a season mm -hmm. where families and friends get together. Mm -hmm. This is the kind of show you can bring. Yeah. Everybody to yes. you know? and come back. We yeah. have people that you think will like and it. And mothers and yeah. fathers yeah. and grandparents. And single and, men. And, I'd like and, to and come together with some that. single men right. in town while I'm here. Mm. And as we go through the holiday season and into the new year, what are your thoughts or wishes as we get into are we 20, talking 20. resolutions? Are we heading into the resolution? You said it, not me. Oh, gosh. Well, you have a resolution. I guess mine would be to try and be a little bit less obnoxious. <laughs> so, and, all right. and mine mm. would be that Carmela is a little less obnoxious. And what do you have, what can you tell us about the future? of the Calamari sisters. Are you going to keep oh. doing this? Do you have any oh. plans to retire? Uh, well, we are. No, we we got to be the Calamari sisters. Okay. <laughs> but in and terms we of the born. shows, yeah, you know, we go with the, we, you know, we go with the flow. We roll yeah. with the punches. Yeah. We, you know, always have something going. Yeah. Um, Some, something's we, always cooking. Something's always cooking. Yeah. It's a good way Even to if put it's it. on the back burner. Ah. I got puns. I got lots ah. of puns. That she does. And very, she, does. I mean, she didn't like puns. Well, I like good mm. puns. Yeah. Yeah, well, so thank you so students. much for, for coming to the Region Theater and uh -huh. also for giving us the time to be on episode three of Region TV, the Ooh. first one we've done live on yeah. site here. Oh, really? Yes. This is just episode. the third episode. Three. Yes, a okay. uh, monthly show, and that you're uh, actually taking time away from your dress rehearsal here. Oh, our pleasure. That our is pleasure. the Thank truth. you that so much for having us. I don't us. know yes. any of my lines. And, and I, I think that my my Christmas wish would be to have you back on this show again next year. Right? Oh, we would love that. Yes, let's make that happen. Let's yeah, make that I want to come out of a big present or you that got big yeah, present. But, well, we, Huge. Yeah, I think, well, you could almost fit Just in those for there. my we'll Christmas strip. No, we're not doing that. Think, think about it. Just no. think. <laughs> <laughs>